guys, Vic here playing Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Today on Skyrim Revisited, I'm going to show you guys how to get your Amber and Madness gear. Um, I explored all around Skyrim, or most of Skyrim. I couldn't find any deposits or veins anywhere that would have these Amber or Madness ores. I spoke to a bunch of merchants throughout the game. None of them sell it, except for these guys. This Khajiit. Caravan merchants. So this one is in Dawnstar. These are the surrounding areas. If you, ha if you find any of these, you'll be able to find Dawnstar, for those that haven't found it yet. So you speak to him. So many refuse. Take a look. And they should sell them. Sometimes they'll sell three, sometimes they'll sell one amber. And here's your madness ores. Basically what I did was I went from city to city looking for these guys. So when you spawn in, you'll probably be facing this way. All you gotta do is turn to your left and they should be right there. You may have to wait 24 to 48 hours and then every hour after that until they appear and they should appear I was lucky enough that as soon as I uh, spawned in here they were right here but this particular one though you can actually take her gold without her knowing there is a hidden chest over here near this mine Beware though, most of the time when I've been spawning into Dawnstar, dragons appear, so. That's where this hidden chest is, and if I'm not mistaken, you can take her gold along with some other stuff that you can sell, see? Once you take the gold from here, she won't have it on her. And you can actually take some of that stuff and sell it to the other Khajiit merchants. So that's where you find that one. I'm going to show you guys where to find these from the ones I found anyways. In Malakarf, I'm going to go there next because sometimes it's a, they don't spawn very well in certain areas. Go to this area. The ones that appear here, they set up shop right next to a bridge. close to where you spawn in. And apparently, yeah, they, they seem to be right here. Just they don't have their tent set up yet. Khajiit, we are creatures of the desert. Take a look. If you guys have any, like, emeralds and stuff like that, flawless anthus, sapphires, you could sell them to these guys. May your old lead you for one or anything you don't really care for, you can sell them to them to keep your gold up. So that's where I found him at Malakarf. Uh, next up is Solitude. I hope this helps people out that are looking for these madness ores. Uh, wow, I found so much place that's not even funny. I figured I'd do this video because I did receive a few comments from people asking where to find madness ores. Believe me, I explored a lot of areas of Skyrim looking for veins or deposits and couldn't find any. Also, check in the Solitude Sewers. The 
hollowed stumps in that area and that one altar where you fight Thoron will respawn these uh, amber and madness ore. Just as you're doing this, just check out. I'll, I'll show you guys when I get done. I'm showing you exactly where the if it's respawned for me, hopefully. Hey, this is where these guys are. In fact, this guy was about to leave. Hey, hey. I welcome you, friend. How Don't leave yet, man. Take a look. See, he sells one, but it changes, like, as you're doing this. This is how I got mine. Like, I just did rotations from city to city. May your road lead looking you for these guys. Alright, so I did Dawnstar, Malakar, Solitude. I'm gonna try right one next. So Dawnstar, Solitude, Malakarf, White Run, and Riften are the ones I found. Khajiit's outside of. I already have the Amber and Madness gear, which I will show you at the end of this video. So you guys can see what it looks like. Thus far I've been lucky. Uh, they actually appeared when I spawned in, but... You, there will be times you have to wait. Like right now. <laughs> For me, anyways. Sometimes they'll come, they'll spawn in after 24 hours. Sometimes it'll be 48. Sometimes a little after 48 hours. For those that don't have it, see, lucky okay, for me. How high only the they rode, like, take a look. So for those that don't have this uh, content, you you'll need the Saints and Seducers Creation Club content for these ores to start appearing. May your road lead you to warm sands. They'll appear in a quest, a long one. <laughs> Alright, so that's right run. Riften is the last one that I've that I know for sure has them. Then after this I'll show you the two other places that should have these. I do appreciate the positive comments and responses I get from these videos. If it's a bed you need, talk to Kirava and be involved. She said Kirava. Alright. Over here. They should be right here where this campfire is. This um, unlit campfire. Let's see where she should be. Oh no. Had to be a dragon, huh? Yeah, you don't want these dragons in the way. Oh boy, really? Just take it. Take the soul, hurry up. Let's 
Sorry about that little detour, guys. Sometimes these dragons appear, and you gotta deal with them. Because I don't want them killing these guys. Oh, I gotta deal with them. Sorry. But, uh, yeah, if they... If they're not here and a dragon shows up, you might want to kill the dragon first. I wouldn't take the chance of them killing a Khajiit merchant, because then that's one less Khajiit merchant you have, and some of these travel to two different cities. Already then. Sometimes this weird stuff happens. Okay, where are they? Take a look. So this one sells like three of them. May your road lead you to They're a little pricey, but so those are the ones I found. You may have to do some waiting. Or you might be lucky and they'll just be right there when you spawn in. So I'm going to show you guys, Let's start with, there are these two areas that when you come, it's during the quest. Alright, so above Mistwatch, right above Mistwatch, you'll um, come across in like a ruin and it's near this in case you, you guys haven't found Mistwatch. Here are the surrounding areas. So as you're going around with these Khajiit merchants trying to buy these ambers and madness ores, check back in these two locations that I'm about to show you. Because they do like respawn after a while. Also in this area, beware of dragons also. I'm going to try to avoid any that might appear. There's skeletons here too, so... Try to hurry and get out of here. Who's there? You knew I heard something. So, for those that don't know exactly where it is, here's where my marker is. Just go above Miss Watch, and there you'll find that. There's some things like ores here and stuff, but I'm hoping that that dragon isn't going to stop me from fast traveling from here. Now the last place is Solitude. Some of you are probably going to ask, why didn't you just do that while you were at Solitude? Well, if there's enemies, it might... Well, not really because of the enemies. I don't want to confuse anyone while I'm look, showing you guys where the Khajiit merchants are. I figured I'd do those first and then these two places afterwards. Although killing the enemies might make it a little longer. <laughs> now for me, I don't know if this is going to happen for everybody, but for me, I would take this butterfly and then when it refills, when they restock, that butterfly will come back for the most part. Which tells me the enemies also respond in here. Uh, 
I have been in here so many times, I know exactly where to go. And here, look for hollowed stumps. You'll get a bunch of amber in those. See? And among oh, a bunch of other stuff, which I'll worry about that later. I'll show you guys where all the hollowed stumps are too while I'm at it. Again guys, you, guys, you have to have the Saints and Seducers Creation Club content. Sometimes these will restock up or respawn, but not the enemies. So. your madness or along with some other stuff that no is part of the original quest for this I already in fact I already have that note it just keeps coming back so there you have it guys basically I just did this over and over again so I'm going to show you guys what this armor looks like. I'll start with the amber. Oh, that's weird. He had a weird glow. Huh. I wonder if this has a hidden perk. Let's check that out right now. Sorry for the slight detour, guys. I'm confused why he had that strange glow when I equipped all that. I don't know if you guys saw it, but it was like a for a couple seconds he glued green. No, nope. nothing new. 
I didn't pick this up anywhere. I actually made this, guys. That's weird. Anyways. That's the madness gear. So I hope this video helps anyone that's looking for amber and madness ores. I like I said I I think I've said it. But if I haven't, I've explored Skyrim and I couldn't find any deposits or veins that had these ores. Spoke to a lot of merchants throughout the game. None of them really sold these. Except for the Khajiit caravan merchants. So just go around talking to those guys. Buy it off of them. Come back to these two areas. And in no time you'll have these two pieces of gear or weapons and stuff. So if you like what you see... If you'd like to see more of my videos, please feel free to subscribe. I usually upload videos frequently. Unless real life gets in the way. But anyways, y'all have a good one. Stay safe. Thanks for watching.